Now the cold cases. A Rhode Island veteran would have been turning 66 this fall, but he won't be celebrating his birthday with his family and friends. Donald Connell disappeared without a trace, and in the nearly 40 years since he vanished, there have been few clues about where he could have gone. Kim Colonian joins us now with his story. Kim? Well, this case has gone largely unreported until now, and Donald's sister is hoping that her online pleas will somehow unearth answers about where her brother went that December day. It should have been a short walk from 6 Record Street in Newport down the hill to a home on Channing. Donald Connell was on foot, making his way from his father's home to his sister's, but he never arrived. At first, the family didn't think much of it. Maybe his plans changed. But when 10 days went by, Donald's dad went to police. It was December 12th, 1986. <laughs> A report we obtained from Newport Police shows Donald Connell Sr. told them he had not argued with his son, and since he last saw him 10 days prior, there had been no phone calls or nothing. Donald, known as Donnie, was 28 at the time. He had been in the Marine Corps for a few years and was currently working at a landscaping company. He had been a basketball whiz at Middletown High School and led the team to the state championships. Police reports note he had a drinking problem. Problem. And his family told investigators about a year prior to this disappearance, he bought a plane ticket to Ireland unannounced. In a police report from 2010, investigators know Donnie's relative told them she had heard rumors about his disappearance. One was a person who was spotted on the Newport Bridge and may have jumped. Or there were sightings of him in New York City. The relative told police she went to Manhattan to search for Donnie, but never found him there. In 2015, Donnie's name was entered into the National Missing and Unidentified Persons System, and a representative from the agency told police they'd be collecting DNA samples and Donnie's fingerprints for their database. His sister, Anita, has taken to Facebook annually on Donnie's birthday, making a plea for answers. Off my lips and into the air is a happy birthday wish and kiss for my missing brother. I search, hope, and dream of finding you. Now, Newport police did provide us with Donald's missing persons report, but so far have not responded to repeated requests for comment on this case. If you or someone you know knows anything about Donald Connell's disappearance, you are urged to contact police. For more information on this case and others, or to tell us about one you think we should investigate, just head to WPRI.com. I'm Kim Kalunian, 12 News.